the internet is it's become just such a such a monolithic thing there it is everybody's got a little piece of it but the internet is the world you can't get out of it unless you die um, and in so, it, there's, there's just there's a certain lack of organization in it it's it, there's um, a lack of it really is a lack of organization it's like it's just a huge yellow pages that uh, has everybody in the whole world is listed in this huge incredibly amazing just gigantic yellow pages listings and it's that difficult and it's in many ways it's not difficult you put in a search word and get but you put in a search word and you typically get millions of responses whatever your search word is and it just that's just ridiculous because even if you had some inclination that you wanted to try to look at all of the results you couldn't There's, there would not be enough time in, a, in thousands of years to look at all the search results for one any just about any search that you enter search word for so there has to be some kind of a system that will reduce all this clutter eliminate this clutter and just really give you what you really need to know and not overwhelm you with millions of of other things that are that you couldn't read even if you tried and then there's the issues of all the stuff about copyright and uh, legality and if you're a bad person because you shared something and somebody has a copyright on it and I wonder if there's some way around that some way of creating something that's not the internet something that's some, it's something else it's like the internet but it's different it's a different system and sort of in the same way I mean it's like there's um micros there's there's regular computers and Microsoft and then there's Apple tried to create a different different system not that I am an Apple user I never have and I don't think I ever will but there are people who love them I guess so I thought that uh, if you could create some kind of a, a, a something that eliminated all the extraneous stuff that that's just completely just clutter as so that each person so a person could like create have their own internet type experience without the clutter just I you turn on your computer and you get the stuff that's relevant to you and none of the rest of that so I thought of if if, if somehow you create a, a, a separate a separate or a parallel system or a, some kind of a system that a filter a filtering system that you could use that would auto it would f it would result in this by filtering out the internet according to what you need and want so that you would just get the stuff that you, that you really want and need and if you enter a search for something you don't get millions of of re responses you might get at most 10 how many res how many responses do you need to any particular search do you really need more than 10 no not if they're the right ones if they're the right results you wouldn't need more than five really so this is my idea instead of calling it the internet call it idea land that's that's my thought. ID land. <sighs> um. Also, how depending how you separate, so depending how you separate it, I ID land could be idea land, land of ideas, or it could be ideal and, or it could be I deal 
and as in poker I deal and so that's my thought I deal hand <laughs> and ideas are important um, I think this is really 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 the problem we have is that there's just lack of any real ideas I mean every it, it, everybody's so busy in some ways and certainly there's millions of people that are very busy with all kinds of ideas creating programs and software and all of this stuff and amazing gadgets and yet in spite of all this incredible amount of inventiveness and braininess there is an overall lack of organization and a lack of everything is just everybody's off doing their own thing but and trying to trying to sort of coordinate with each other in a haphazard sort of way but nothing's really coordinated in a deliberate type of way that's my feeling about it and when it comes to people actually actually think thinking about the world and and life and stuff they're too busy just thinking about how to do their job and how to create new products but to think about what life is really all about it should be all about and how to go about it that that's just that's too much so people can't deal with that so that's the sort of thing I want to do with Idealand <laughs>